eight type of wholesome consciousness <clears throat> now do you remember the first one first consciousness what is the first of wholesome mind somanas yes yes unprompted okay <clears throat> number 2 somanas sahagatam jnana sampayottam sasankarika somanas sahagatam accompanied by pleasure jnana sampayottam associate with knowledge sasankarikan prompted example someone encourage you to offer dana okay please come to our center uh, uh, we have the many bantis there and you can offer dana this way someone encourage to somebody to offer dana at that time he follow his friends advice so arising this mind because he after listening the about both the dham and sang arising the happiness and he also believe the karma and result of the karma that's why he follow the his friend to offer dana at that time arising prompted mind because he follow the others advice it's one way the second way really you want to offer dana but to heavy rain cannot go okay example very heavy rain but anyway later thing i want to go but you are going there to offer dana but not the strong mind offering dana with the weak mind okay because of the weak mind but anyway you are doing kusala you are doing holsa you are doing the good meritorious deed arising the second mind okay understand number 3 somanas sahagatam jnan vipayuttam asankarika one consciousness accompanied by pleasure disassociate with knowledge unprompted example uh, some kids you are bringing to the monastery when we are pay respect to the buddha he also pay respect but he don't have the he doesn't know the meaning doesn't know the benefit of the offer the pay respect offering but any anyway, he follow his mother and father's elders way arising he is when he do the okas the do the pay respect bow down at that time arising happiness but no more wisdom but the small boy he doing this kusala by himself arising unprompted okay the same way number 4 somanas sahagatam jnana vipayuttam sasankarikan one consciousness arising accompanied by pleasure disassociate with knowledge and prompted the same way when we are bring the kids for your monastery okay but kids doesn't know how to pay respect you are teaching okay okay this you do pay respect like this like right? teaching at that time he follow but he happy but no wisdom prompted my you understand 
Okay. Last four. Upekka, important thing. Equanimity. Who doesn't have strong faith for the Buddha Dhamma Sangha? Those are people, when they are doing the good thing, not happiness, but they are not worry also. Their mind also equal. Means the the neuter, neuter. Example nowadays the the I can compare the uh, the uh, the the majority of the Buddhist of people in the co Buddhist countries. The the female's faith is stronger than male. It is true. There is some, that's why the, sometimes our, the, some teachers also explain, because of the, uh, this reason, so many, the female deva in the deva world. <laughs> the, but anyway, the, we have to understand, when we are doing good thing with equanimity, with upekka. At that time arising one of the upekka mind. The one more thing, the about the number fifth, upekka sahagata jnana sampayottang asankharika. Upekka sahagata means accompanied by equanimity. Jnana Sampayottam associate with knowledge, unprompted. This mind also quite powerful consciousness. If someone doing deep vipassana, practicing deep vipassana, example, the deep vipassana knowledge, the near the Sankha Rupeka, near the, near the, the the path and portion knowledge. When his mind going to deeply to see the, the all uh, condition things, it is impermanent, suffering and non-self. When he is practicing continuously, his mind become upekka. No more the happiness just like before. Because he understood everything, everything impermanent. So this way, very easy to appear. Uh, upekka, the equanimity, wisdom, mind, during the vipassana meditation moment. The same way, uh, some meditators, they are taking undesirable object. Okay? We know, according to our life, when we are taking the undesirable object, all is arising anger, ill will. It is true. But who are the meditators? Those are the practitioner, practitioner, they are taking the undesirable object. At that time cannot appear unwholesome. Appear, appear arising wholesome mind, that mind, it's called upekka sahakatan jnana sampayutan asankarikan. The one consciousness arising with equanimity, associate with wisdom and unprompted. Okay? The same way, you can understand number six. One consciousness arising, accompanied by equanimity, associate with knowledge and prompted. How about example? Okay.
okay one next i am the meditator okay someone so when undesirable object when i am taking the undesirable object i am not disattached to this object i am not arise ill will because of that object i always try to see the uh the, that object also impermanent suffering and non self this way i am reflecting because of that arising with equanimity and wisdom knowledge but prompted why i follow the others advice anyway do you know the bante nagasena and king milind the one of the book milind panja do you know anyway before no so after uh, if i not wrong na after third sangha council one of the king actually he is not indian he came from europe okay that king name milind and but he very skillful about the the lord buddha's teaching but he has the different type of question regarding buddhist buddha's teaching then he finding who is know the answer for my question but cannot find the one of the young bhikkhu because name nagasena his arahat that bante gave the all the answer the later that q and uh, the question and answer become one book nowadays we also can read very important very wonderful book what they have done in the past life to get like this like this wisdom actually two of them in the many life ago is in the one monastery teacher and one disciple na bante nagasena is one of the teacher his disciple the king of milind okay but the teacher always the clean in the around the bodhi tree around the the monastery all the time cleaning but the student don't want to join don't want to help one day the teacher punish him you should do this kusala this import we are doing service for the buddha dhamma sangha anyway he don't want but one day the teacher collect all the rubbish thing to the one corner then give the punishment to uh, to clean up all but the son the student okay may i do then he clean up all after that he went to, to the one of the tank to take shower to tank at that time he make aspiration about his kusala oh today i clean up the all rubbish thing because of this merit help to me every life until get nibbana every life life to life i want to get the deep and uh, very wonderful wisdom and i want to be the skillful about tipitaka buddha's teaching and i want to ask many kind of question regarding tipitaka like this he make aspiration the teacher is stay behind but actually the student doesn't know teachers following behind okay teacher also uh, also make aspiration one day when he start to ask any kind of question regarding tipitaka i want to give the answer for him okay i want to give the answer for him this anyway two of them they fulfill the parami the one day they met together 
I want to know, I want to explain what is the kusala, mind. The teacher always clean up the, the ground, the, the compound of the, the monastery. Then he know the benefit of the, this act, uh, activity, this service, volunteer service for the Buddha Dhamma Sangha. No? Because of that, his mind very pure, very calm, very happy and arise wisdom mind, unprompted. When he ordered the student to do this activity, he follow his advice. But his mind sometimes wisdom, arise wisdom, but prompted. But anyway, he also got the benefit. The same way, when we are doing the somanas, happiness wholesome or equanimity wholesome, they have the, we have the benefit. Okay? We have the benefit. Then the, regarding the last four consciousness, you can understand? Okay, last, last four. Number fifth, we know uh, one consciousness arising accompanied by equanimity associated with knowledge and unprompted. Number seven, so number six, one consciousness arising accompanied by equanimity associated with knowledge and prompted. Number seven, one consciousness accompanied by equanimity disassociated with knowledge and prompted. Number eight, one consciousness accompanied by equanimity disassociated with knowledge prompted. Do you need any example? Understand? Can apply? Sometime you are the you are feeling sick. Okay? You cannot the still your, your body body pain, example. Huh? But anyway you want to do the dana. Because of the pain, very not easy to get the happiness. But at that time can appear upekka. Upekka, the equanimity consciousness. The same way, if we know the uh, truth, Dhamma in this world, Lord Buddha mentioned, all are things impermanent. All are things should give up. Because one day, when uh, one day we have to uh, give up all, we cannot bring anything for the next life. Our external, all our properties, even internal, this, the body also, we cannot bring. If someone know the way, someone know that those are uh, method, then he never ever attached to his body, attached to his internal and external properties. Then the, all the time when he taking his the thing to use, or maybe uh, he want to uh, uh, use some his own properties. But he using without attachment. This meaning can be arise kusala. Example, we are bhikkhu. Okay? Now the, I am wearing chivara, the, the robes. I never ever attached to, cannot be attached to this cloth. Why? Same. Every day same color, same, same thing. Even this one, the new or bad, nobody criticizes. Nobody blame. Then, when I wear in this one, I have to reflect about the chivara, about the robe. I am wearing for the cover of my body. And I want to save my body from the, the, some sickness, maybe some outside, the, from the cold, the, the, for the weather. Anyway, I, have, I am reflecting. At that, at that time, also arising wholesome, unwholesome. Wholesome. 
sometime upekka equanimity because every day we are doing this on the same thing become habitual thing become upekka you also be careful when you are doing the good thing sometime you want to every day you want to do the chanting or you want to offer, offer the candle for the buddha first day second day third day one week one month you are very happy ha huh? you are very happy after few month become normal it is true or not check your mind at that time, very easy to appear upekka equanimity okay at this way you should understand what is the difference between uh, with the pleasure consciousness and equanimity consciousness okay understand okay now the, the those are eight wholesome consciousness sorry same yeah meaning same action different the, the, the words all are same example brother now i am doing kusala wholesome okay one day i can get the result same one same result small small there but this is this is not the uh, accurate example brother has a, uh, the money okay brother want to buy something the the money after give the say the you can get the property okay the like exchange the your property the change the, the other thing when we are doing the wholesome this wholesome we giving the result for us now this moment we we already got we have the good perfect faculties i ear nose tongue body eh then we have the wisdom we have the good friend dhamma brothers dhamma sisters and we can listen them we can understand them those are things appear this life because of what because from where from the past life one day one of the uh, one of the son of the one of the millionaire's son it's we call suba suba is quite young boy uh, i i don't want to explain the, the quite long history but anyway he asked uh, some question from the buddha as the lord as bante nowadays we can see in this world some beings they have long life someone doesn't have the long life the short life what is the reason the lord buddha mentioned yes they have the reason in the past life somebody never ever kill any animal any beings they always release the animal because of this merit because of this wholesome giving result for him to stay long life okay someone has a short life because of what is the reason because of they kill the animal destroy the others life in the past in the past life because of that they cannot get the longer life again us pante someone very healthy people i we can see in this world someone very sick what is the reason the lord buddha mentioned in the past karma someone already practice compassion karuna compassion for the others all the time he is living out of compassion for the people because of that he can get the healthy life someone not practicing compassion always quarrel with each other blame each other fight with each other always give the punishment for others because of that 
we cannot get the healthy life. Everything coming. Now this life, we can see quite successful our life. Those are things, those are resultant coming from where? In the past life. We already had done, have, had done may, many type of wholesome deed, good deeds. Because of that, we got the good life. That's why the, the, we, the wholesome, okay? Now we have eight type of wholesome. The same mind can give the same result. That's why the result of mind is the same. Okay? <clears throat> I think others, maybe you can understand. Okay? Uh, okay. Lesson number four. Lesson four. Sense fear, resultant and functional consciousness. Kama vachara, vipaka, chitta and kiriya chitta. First of all, resultant mind. There are eight. I think the same meaning. Okay? Same meaning. The, anyway, we can un, try to get the meaning briefly. One consciousness accompanied by pleasure associated with knowledge unprompted. One consciousness accompanied by pleasure associated with knowledge prompted. One consciousness accompanied by pleasure disassociated with knowledge unprompted. One consciousness accompanied by pressure disassociated with knowledge prompted. One consciousness accompanied by equanimity disassociated with knowledge unprompted. One consciousness accompanied by equanimity associated with knowledge prompted. One consciousness accompanied by equanimity disassociated with knowledge unprompted. One consciousness accompanied by equanimity disassociated with knowledge prompted. This is a, those are eight types of resultant mind. How we understand this one? Example. During the my life, okay, during the my life, I offered very beautiful flower basket to the Buddha. It is very memorable uh, thing for my life. Okay? When I free, all the time I remind this, this thing. Okay? All the time uh, remind me. Then nearly my dead moment, nearly dead moment, arising the same kusala. That kusala, mind arising. Which mind? First one example. Wholesome, well, first one. Yeah, with pleasure and with wisdom, unprompted mind. Okay? The same mind, after I did, can give the result in the birth link in mind. My birth link in mind become with pleasure, with knowledge, unprompted resultant mind. Now you understand? The same result given. Example. Our, do you know the, our Bodhisattva? Who is Bodhisattva? Siddhartha Bodhisattva, do you know? Okay. Our Bodhisattva, before come to human world, where did he stay? To Sita world. Okay. Nearly passed away, nearly that moment, our Bodhisattva practiced metta meditation. Okay. He get the deep concentration, not the jhana concentration. Okay. Not the jhana concentration. He got the the 
metta, deep concentration, not attain the jhana. Before the jhana, he passed away. This wholesome mind, this the loving kindness object, again give the result in the partisandhi moment in the human, human world. That's why after he reborn in this world, first day, he make the very wonderful announcement in this world, for the world, no? I am the elder, I am the senior, I am the super man in this world. This is my last life. Don't know more any new life. Because why? After, after Bodhisattva, he checked his mind. He understood. I am the senior, I am the super wonderful person in this world. Highest person in this world. According to his Patisandhi. According to his birth link in mind moment. The, the same, the Kusana is a one consciousness the accompany with pleasure and knowledge, unprompted, the same vipaka, but his birth link in manu, same. Then the, the, this way we can understand eight types of resultant mind. If someone offering dana according to other, okay, the, nowadays the, because now you have the different type of friend. Someone not Buddhist. Okay? But anyway, they never criticize Buddhists. They also have a good friendship with the Buddhists. But they don't know anything regarding Buddhists, how to offer dana, how we make the good thing. One day, you, one day, because of you, the, one of the, uh, unreligion person doing the kusala. But arising wholesome, arising happiness, wisdom, but prompted. Maybe only that kusala he already done in this life. Example. Last moment can appear the same mind. Then he can get the same result. All the time, one of the eight kusala Come in the, arise in the nearly dead moment, the same resultant coming in the next life. Okay? Now you understand? The, what is the bit, difference between the wholesome and resultant? Okay? Now, the, in this world, we can see. Uh, some type of abnormal people, abnormal. The, what is their partisan? How about their birth link in my moment? Hmm? No more wisdom. It is true? Yeah. What is the karma? What is their past, the, which kind of object arose the nearly dead moment? Very, very weak one of the kusala. Means no more powerful. Very, very weak one of the wholesome appear near the dead moment. But that wholesome, no more wisdom. Very weak. Because of that, he reborn in the human world, abnormal. And they may be handicapped, blind, cannot walk anymore, cannot talk. But his partisandi, his birth link in mind, cannot be one of the eight from he, like here. The, his, the birth link in mind, the different. Not, not related to this this consciousness. Now the, nowadays, sometimes you can see some people, 
we are living together but very di- but his look like complete his fact all the the body but he cannot understand anything huh we have to push every, every time you do this thing this day this way this way, all the time but when we are pushing he can do after the forget it have you experience because like this people how we understand no more knowledge in the birth link in moment because now we we are talking disassociate knowledge consider one of the disassociate knowledge consciousness appear the birth link in mind moment like the 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 the, the participant the moment sorry yes yeah the sometime the some some abnormal people they are always laughing this means there is there birth linking moment arising happiness but no more wisdom someone always crying someone uh not happiness always want to fight or want to quarrel those are people can be equanimity and there no wisdom okay one more thing now you can de- uh, you can decide by yourself which kind of the how about your the birth link in mind when we are so doing the uh, function together okay and when you are talking with each other someone always is still the happiness always smile if good or bad thing come always smile never ever get angry and the 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 life was very charm very, very calm very peaceful ah those are peoples the birth link in mind moment with pleasure someone very smart but very easy to get angry hmm and very easy to get misunderstand but only few minute after that okay finish Then again have the good relationship those are people almost their partisan is equanimity but wisdom then you can understand by yourself if you want to check your birth link in mind moment really you want to check you should meditate okay after practice the uh, mentality and materiality then you can go to the, the practice the defending origination method at that time you can see you can check what is the my birth link in mind moment and what i have done in the past life to get the like this life you can check by yourself okay may you try after you study this one when you are free try to develop your concentration it is more important without practice meditation we cannot understand abhidhamma abhidhamma is a meditation object now i am giving the only theoretical knowledge not the practical knowledge this theoretical knowledge very important for us to practice develop our meditation without practical knowledge you cannot understand okay same 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 <coughs> similar words all are jnana panya all similar words how many similar words for the panya i can use pali yeah? but i don't know english <laughs> uh, I, they have the i remember more than 30 similar words according to the buddha teaching i can recite panya pajanana vichayo pavichayo dhamma vichayo sallakkana upalakkana pachchupalakkana 
పండిచ్చాం కోసాల్లాం నైపుణ్యం వైభవ్య చింత ఉపపరిక భూరి మేధ పరినాయిక సంపజన్యం పతోదు పాన్య పాన్యంద్రియ ఎక్సెట్రా మెనీ దిస్ వి జ్ఞాన పాన్య ఓల్ ఆ సిమిలర్ వర్డ్స్ బట్ దే దే హ్యావ్ ద డిఫరెంట్ డెఫినేషన్ ద వర్డ్ బట్ ఎనీవే ద సేమ్ థింగ్ దట్స్ వై నాలెడ్జ్ విస్డమ్ సమ్టైమ్ వి క్యాన్ సీ ద వాయిస్ అటెన్షన్ the some the uh, some teacher told me the can of find some english word also for the explain the some pali words okay the wisdom panya same ah uh, may the yeah, maybe the the same but the similar word the the evana so sampajanya yeah same 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 panya okay uh okay now the we have the chitta process one of the chitta process to explain actually uh, this is the not the time to explain this one oh yeah yeah okay this the not the time to explain this one but an, anyway the i want to explain background of the resultant mind how we understand okay then the word the notes we park because his previous earlier life we did wholesome so we can get the wholesome result in this life you understand here are the resultant consciousness rebirth link in consciousness okay other thing no need to think but the uh, life continuing dead consciousness it's okay no, no no need to think okay please the you check about the chart the chitta process consciousness at moment of death and rebirth now the, the present life and next life okay present life and next life final consciousness of near death process they are at that time five impulsion consciousness arising one of the eight wholesome mind okay one of the eight the, the those are five wholesome the same same the those are five consciousness are same one of the eight wholesome consciousness arising in the nearly dead moment if these are accompanied by pleasure associated with wisdom and unprompted also mind arising near the death moment after next life before next life there is a death mind after death mind arising rebirth link in consciousness what is the consciousness name then this will be accompanied by pleasure associate with knowledge unprompted also resultant mind okay now you can put the many example no the i remember uh, one of the history our bodhisatta uh, one day uh, he became the one of the elephant the very powerful elephant and he got the two wife this danger no if a two wife always fighting no eh? for the one husband but anyway he got the two wife but the second wife always misunderstand about the bodhisatta he think not supporting me well always support the uh, the, the main other wife but anyway the three of them very clever but they are still animal elephant do uh, at that period no more uh, uh, lord buddha but at that uh, that period appear the pacheka buddha silent buddha 500 silent buddha approach to the that forest near the himalay forest okay then those are elephant take eight sila very good no <laughs> eight sila 
after that they are find the uh, fruits from the forest then gather to the one place and offer to the all are 500 the noble the sorry the silent buddha offer after offering the second wife she make aspiration wonderful aspiration it is actually it's not good aspiration yeah but she made the very good kusala no she thought today i got eight sila and i offer fruits dana to for the 500 pacheka buddha silent buddhas i got the very strong merit one day i after passed away near the death moment i want to the appear this kusala because of this kusala i want to get human life however i want to be one of the princess in the uh, varanasi city kingdom one day i want to marry the king then i want to be the powerful wife queen then after that because of this life always i got the trouble because of the, this wife and the the husband one day i want to after that i want to send the uh, one hunter to kill the husband this elephant and to take the his trucks two trucks then like this he make aspiration she make aspiration anyway because it's strong kusala but he she make the bad no good again the it is uh yeah it is it's very bad but anyway because of that she passed away earlier okay because it's, then she reborn the in the the varanasi city then she became the uh, queen and she sent the one hunter kill the bodhisatta okay my means near the death moment appear this very good wholesome mind at that kusala that that, that wholesome the first one that's why the uh, somanasa sahagata jnana sampada asankharika consciousness the same resultant ap- mind appear in the part the birth linking moment in the human world okay this way we can understand how the resultant mind appear for us okay anything you don't understand hmm? you want to know some more example okay uh during the kasapa buddha's time one of the bhikkhu this was the two of the bhikkhu practice meditation diligently 20000 years continues their meditate their monk life but two of them always going pindapata for the village after arms round one bhikkhu his pin, his arms always share with the other bhikkhus one bhikkhu don't want to offer he always eat alone but who is sharing the food that bhikkhu always advise to his friend please don't eat alone you should share with other bhikkhus important for you but he don't want to listen but anyway they are good friend but their morality concentration wisdom are same but one bhikkhu already give dana some bhikkhu one bhikkhu not give dana only different thing the the two of bhikkhus after passed away reborn in the deva world who offer dana that will be, become very powerful deva good quality deva 
the, uh, that because that the, the, uh, everything higher than others who not offer dana that because also become their very poor quality okay no more quality then after that two of them after deva world they reborn in the human world the who is the powerful deva that deva became the one of the son of king kosala he appeared in the palace reborn in the palace another deva he reborn in the palace but in the slave family poor family who the the who is the doing the service for the kingdom the king and family the, the, this family the poor family but they stay together because the same day same time they reborn because of they stay together one day two of them can remind their past life then they still young they are talking each other they 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 are, they are communicating each other discussing about their what they have done in the past life later the this history this, this thing listen uh, listen the one of the uh, daughter of the king kosa the, that called daughter called sumana okay sumana that the sumana report to lord buddha the lord buddha mention it is true but when we are offering giving dana giving items then opening charity for others we will be rich every life we can get whatever we need why <clears throat> the morality concentration wisdom three uh, three uh, three rain training related to the nibbana only for nibbana only to get the liberation that's why nowadays all are the buddhist people they are practicing sila samadhi panya to get the liberation those are thing three uh, three uh, training can produce nibbana can lead the nibbana but offering dana doing charity also helpful for us to the, to get the nibban and we can get the whatever thing in future life that's why the the but two of them anyway they got arahashtip later but one of the bikku he successful his life the another bikku also not successful because he is poor now i want to explain but the same kusala mind appear near the dead moment but how they become the different life because their morality concentration wisdom all are same but the same mind appear near the dead moment but the same resultant mind appear near after birth link in mind moment but two of them different why someone doing the different meritorious activities someone doesn't do meritorious activities the, that's why nowadays we are also we are all are sometimes our all are birth link in my mind same our participant mind same but we are each other different why we are we have done different different thing in the past life but this way you should uh, try to get the result in mind how appear for us okay nearly dead moment appear the one of the powerful kusala wholesome mind because of that we can get the result in the future life okay
காமாவச்சர கிரிய சித் சென்ஸ்பியர் ஃபங்க்ஷனல் கான்சியஸ்னஸ் ஓன்லி ஃபோர் அரஹத் மீன்ஸ் ஃபார் த லோட் புத்தா ஃபார் த சைலண்ட் புத் அண்ட் அரஹத் those our mind cannot appear for us okay <clears throat> okay then the similar meaning same meaning somanas sahagatang jnana sampayottang asankarika asankarika ka asankarika one consciousness accompanied by pleasure associate with knowledge or wisdom unprompted okay okay this one how we understand for the arahat we don't have any experience no we don't have any experience but we can get the meaning from the lord buddha's teaching some arahat they are practicing jhana they attain jhana uh, they practice vipassana okay especially they are practicing jhana after rose of the jhana they can reflect their jhana with the first jhana or second jhana or third jhana etc when they are reflecting their first second third jhana at that time arising first functional mind one consciousness accompanied by pleasure associate with knowledge unprompted okay the same way some arahat also after pindapada they also sharing food for others actually no need no why no need no ribbon no more no yeah already nibbana no more life they no need but they are also doing offering and do the service bante uh, uh, sometime the some senior bhikkhu senior arahat bante sariputta bante maha moggala naso doing service for the sangha doing service for the lord buddha at that time they are doing everything with the happy the pleasure with happy, the with happiness and wisdom mind unprompted arising first functional mind the important point one of the important place someone after arahat chip they can reflect they are path knowledge and fruition knowledge and whatever defilement cut off from the with the path knowledge and nibbana object when they are reflecting those are object arising somanas jnana sampayutta asankarika mai okay same as because this some arahat also giving dhamma to teaching dhamma for others <coughs> when they are teaching which kind of mind arising same this mind our lord buddha also giving dhamma to explaining the lie down the, the discipline rule explaining uh, samatha vipassana meditation all the time arising first functional mind okay number 2 one consciousness accompany by pleasure associate with knowledge prompted i remember one history during the buddha's time 
some of great arahat of lord buddha's disciple they gather to the one place one of the forest they each other discuss they are discussing dhamma then the bante sariputta is a leader of them bante sariputta as okay uh, venerable maha kasapa how about the understanding about the anyway ask let's get question ask regarding then bante maha kasapa explain explain his own experience and same bante anuruddha and bante maha moggallana then they all the arahat follow the bante sariputta that advice at that time arising prompted with pleasure and associate with wisdom prompted mind okay number third somanasa sahagata jnana vipayuttam asankarika one consciousness arising accompanied by pleasure disassociate with knowledge unprompted can appear like this mind for the arahat how we understand example now okay after 5 years i will be arahat example na but before arahat in this life i already make some bad thing i is call it to somebody i criticize somebody okay or maybe the uh, i make some bad thing for others after arahat ship still i remember what i have done when i reflect in my mind i can catch oh i make the troubles and for others like i can i can remind at that time i can laugh i'm laughing because my weak point no our weak weak point at that time can appear unwisdom mind the same way any arahat they are reflecting their own uh, their unwholesome thing can appear unwisdom mind the another thing some arahat after destroy the all defilement they cannot destroy their previous habitual karma it is true yes i remember one small the history one dayaka the one donor invited to the the mahatera to come to pindapatha for his his house but mahatera told i am very busy i cannot follow i cannot come to your house you can if you need any bhikkhu you can bring this my samanera my disciple actually samanera so already arahat but the donor not happy but donor doesn't know anything okay then the when they are the samanera pinda going pinda path to house but dai ka so following him then the on the way there is small is small the small the pit the small hole okay then always samanera jump eh huh? the overcome the like jump jump like jumping like running no then the don't no happy oh maybe i should not offer requisite for bante <laughs> eh? i offer only the food i don't want to offer requisite i don't have any faith okay then later after seeing the small the hole then he no jump go slowly slowly but slowly no his down his turn change his his way change then the donor he said, oh what happened <laughs> no change his way ask bante before you 
way, now this way different. What is the meaning? Then the Samana wrote, yes, if I jump again, I cannot get food also. <laughs> because now you already decide to not offer requisite. Okay? If I jump again, I cannot get Pindapata. Uh, this Samana already read his, his donor's mind. Okay? Ah, this is a habitual karma. We cannot change. Okay? The same way, during the Buddha's time, I remember, I remember, but I forget, I not remember clearly the arahat or not, but anyway, when the Lord Buddha giving Dhamma talk, one of the bhikkhu shaking the uh, branch of the tree, one of the bhikkhu holding the earth, huh? so one of the bhikkhu looking the sky. Okay? Then Lord Buddha mentioned, oh, what is the reason? They have habitual karma. Who is uh, shaking the branch? Many, many life ago, continuously they got the monk life, the, sorry, the monkey life. <laughs> because of the, the, his habitual karma, cannot change. The same way, the, the, some arahat after destroy the defilement, but they cannot destroy the habitual karma. Only Lord Buddha can destroy habitual karma. Because if Lord Buddha used the different, different people, no more faith, no more belief, the Buddha. Understand? Ah. The, when the arising habitual karma all the time can appear unwisdom, disassociate with knowledge, consciousness. Sometimes happiness, sometimes equanimity. Okay? Understand? Okay, number fourth. One consciousness arising accompanied by pleasure disassociate with knowledge and prompted. Also see, the sometime uh, some bhikkhu, they remind. Some arahat to some bhikkhu remind him. Oh, before arahat, you already commit like this akusala, like this akusala. Then when they remind, oh yes, I already make done like this. My be yes, I have experience. At that time it was arising, prompted consciousness. But anyway, for the arahat, no more result. All the functional consciousness. But when we are reflecting the, our unwholesome act, we are producing one, some more unwholesome result in view for future. That's why Lord Buddha always mentioned sabba papasa akarana don't do any evil thing by mind, by verbally, by bodily. Okay? Kusala sampada you should cultivate wholesome by mind, by bodily, by verbally. Sachitta pariyodapanang, you should maintain your mind. You should develop your wisdom. Samatha and vipassana meditation. Etang buddhana sasana, this is a Buddha's teaching. But important for us to avoid unwholesome thing from our life. We have to cultivate wholesome. But for the arahat, they never ever do any evil or bad thing after get arahashi. But because of their habitual karma, people can misunderstand. One of the bhante in the Buddha's time, it's we call. Pirindavacha. Pirind bante Vacha. That Bhante always, when they call to the people, use the bad word. 
bad word. Actually, those are words very painful after listening. Then somebody criticizes. Oh, how that one they talk like this, like this. When Lord Buddha mentioned, he already arahasip, but he using this word at that not arising evil. Because his bad habitual come in the past life. Many, many life continuously he reborn in the Brahmin family. Then when he the the Brahmin always controlling the low caste people. Always scholar to the others. Because of this karma, habitual karma following him. Ah, this way we have to think, we also have some na- habitual karma or not. Everybody have. We are each other not same. Every, every, everyone has the habitual karma. Which kind of habitual karma? Different, people different. Someone very easy to get angry. But only one minute, two minutes finish. Someone very easily attached to others. Hmm? They have, we have the, each other, we have the different kind of habitual karma. Okay. <clears throat> now, according to the uh, eight type of the function of consciousness, we can understand uh, according to the wholesome. Because the, when we are doing the good thing, good thing, wholesome arising. The same thing doing the, for the arahat, arising function. Okay? Do you have anything? <coughs> Opeka, Opeka, unwisdom mind, sometimes wisdom mind. Because they cannot ha- be a happiness, cannot is mine. Okay? Example, Bhante, Angulimala. Angulimala killed many, more than 1,000 people. But anyway, last moment he got Arahashi. After that, sure he remained his past bad karma, no? But he never. Uh, it's mine because of his past karma. He keep quiet. It's arising equanimity. Okay. Wholesome. Okay, you need the wholesome, no? Okay. Catch the meaning. Okay. Okay. <coughs> Example, our life. Okay, I can like this. Uh, one consciousness accompanied by equanimity disassociated with knowledge unprompted. Okay, this one. <clears throat> Someone doesn't know about Buddhist, Buddha's teaching. Someone uh, doesn't know result of the wholesome. Okay? And he never ever believed the karma and result of the karma. But he, uh, one day, he met, uh, okay, one day he saw the Buddha image, example. Okay, Buddha image. But he doesn't know this Buddha. Hmm? But after seeing, become normal, it's my no happiness. Then, don't have any wisdom. Any the knowledge the to to know the this Buddha. 
But anyway, he see image by himself, unprompted. The same way, uh, example, the someone uh, very easy to get angry. Okay, his life no more. Uh, we cannot see any smile. His hold his life. The someone uh, example in the the some officer. The, the, the group leader, they don't know to smile for others. Okay? No more smile. But, this, the, but their mind always very hard, very tight, not open. The, the, but those are people also, after seeing the, the good object also, they don't, not, they're not happy. Arising, equanimity, and they don't know to understand. Unwisdom, the unprompted. I can give one another example for the children nowadays. Children, the parents are Buddhist, example. The children nowadays they study in different, different culture after going to school. Very difficult to explain for them about the Buddha, Dhamma, Sangha, but they don't believe. They, they think, oh, cannot be happen like these people in this world, Buddha. Huh? Why you respect this image? What's the reason? They can complain because they don't, they don't have any the background. But the, like this, the children, after go to the monastery, after go somewhere, after they have seen the Buddha image or Sangha, they are not happy, arising only equanimity, equanimity mind. Then don't have wisdom to understand what is the meaning of this object, this associate knowledge. But they are seen by themselves unprompted. The same way, we are bringing the children to the monastery, but they are not happy, no wisdom. The fairy says, okay, you see, this is Buddha. This is Buddha. You respect, but they are doing, but not happy because they are not good, don't have any good feeling. Even nowadays, some people, some children don't want respect to their own parents also. Huh? But according to our Buddhist culture, uh, when I was young, before ordained, every day we pay respect to our mother, father. Before go to school, sometimes before sleep. Because this is a, the background of the Buddhist culture, Buddhism. But nowadays, the young generation, they don't want to bow down for the senior. Huh? Very difficult to teach for them the, what is the good and bad. That's why the, those are people after associating the monastery or bhikkhu, or maybe they're for the good object, arise very easy to appear the equanimity mind. For the understand? Yes, correct. Because why? Object is a wholesome object. Nature of the object. Nature of the object wholesome. Because why? After seeing, they are not criticized, not appear the, the, the angry mind. Some, some after seeing. Not, not, uh, not criticize, but just follow the parents. But they're not happy because they say, oh, I have to go to school, I have the homework. But they have mind, but anyway, they're not criticized, not complaining. Then the, they are come to the, pay respect to the, with the mother, but they're not happy, no understand. But it's still wholesome, but very big, very big wholesome. That's why like this wholesome, if appear the nearly that moment, they cannot get the good life. Okay? Especially nowadays for the kids, for the children. The, this thing, this, uh, this one, uh, like this concept we can understand, we can see. Because the, I also know some the people, some children, 
uh, after seeing bhikkhu, they don't have good feeling. Even they don't want to see bhikkhu, don't want to pay respect. But if they are doing the, with the bad mind, arising akusala, unwholesome. But they are, because of parents doing, they cannot say anything, but just keep silent. But they, they, are, uh, they don't want to do anything. But still, after seeing good object, wholesome, but very, very weak wholesome. Okay. <coughs> Actually, this is the, not the time to explain this one the, the, regarding the, our lesson, but anyway, I can answer. Usually in our the life, every time, javana should be seven javana. All the rest seven javana. But nearly dead moment is very weak body, weak mind. Cannot produce seven javana. This is the nature of the mind. Only five javana arising. Because the, the, it is nearly dead moment, they are very weak. Uh, sometimes the, the, uh, the mind also very weak. And with this one, uh, because of that, nearly dead moment arises only five javana maximum. Cannot be more than five. Cannot be less than five. This is a mean, okay? Yes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, actually, this one related to the panya, wisdom. Okay? Related to wisdom. <coughs> there are, especially there are seven types of uh, condition to arise wisdom. The number two, Vattu Visada Kiriyata, page number 25th, okay? Uh, Vattu Visada Kiriyata, making the, the basis both internal and external. Actually, the meaning, if you want to develop your meditation, example, the, actually this is the, the meditation, the Panya. If you want to develop the wisdom you should clean internal and external properties one example okay you want to meditate in this hall everywhere rubbish very dirty very dust you can meditate cannot one thing after you, you can, you can go to meditate, you can meditate, but cannot focus. Because the, all are the, the, everywhere the very dirty thing. Disturb for us to develop our wisdom. That's why we should clean up all before we start the meditation. The same way, your internal, the property, or maybe the, your, you not take shower, maybe it arises the bad smell from your cloth. But you have, when you are meditating, you are taking a very subtle object. Very, very subtle object you are taking for meditation. Meditation object is very subtle. Then very easy to get a small, bad thing, smell is very easy to get. Then disturb for your meditation. This is the main reason. I can give one example. <coughs> One day, uh, Bhante Sariputta also, uh, he already arahatship, no? Arahat. But uh, meditate one place around the, this area, not clean. Without cleaning. Then, Lord Buddha uh, came to that place and uh, put the Lord Buddha's footprint. Give the message for the Bhante Sariputta. After rose of the meditation, Bhante Sariputta, see the already Lord Buddha came here. Read the, the object. Oh. Lord Buddha gave the message. Sariputta, 
before meditate before meditate before practice meditation you should clean around the area because after after clean your mind become very calm very peaceful i can give one now one more example how many benefit we can get after clean the compound or maybe the buddha's area how many benefit we can get there are five benefits saka chittam pasidati first of all our mind become very happy para chittam pasidati after seeing others also they are very happy devata rakanti always deva protect us asamolo kalam karod nearly dead moment we can die with consciously with consciously and kaya sabeda param marana sukatin sargan lokam upajyati definitely after death we can get the good patisandhi okay we can get the good patisandhi this way the important uh, thing for uh, this this the same meaning coming for the sister not only for wisdom for the concentration also the lord buddha mentioned if someone want to develop the concentration we should uh, practice the clean the internal external our properties things okay oh <clears throat> uh javana means there are three types of javana okay wholesome unwholesome and functional okay functional wholesome and unwholesome arising only for us for the ordinary person except arahat for the arahat arise only functional consciousness for the javana our javana and arahat javana different different quality because we our javana we can get the result but arahat javana cannot get result already they cut off the work okay you want to practice mathematics page number 31 not wholesome uh, wholesome mistake no okay no wholesome unwholesome or resultant okay okay kiriya me not wholesome not unwholesome or not resultant just action only anyway those are all consciousness we can divide into according to the feeling according to the knowledge according to the prompting ah. this is the, this is mathematic you have to count how many pleasure how many uh, somanas a mind consciousness yes 4 plus 4 plus 4 become 12 for wholesome for resultant for functional how many equanimity consciousness yeah 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus very easy no associate with knowledge how many consciousness yeah same this associate with knowledge how many same unprompted consciousness same 4 plus 4 plus 4 prompted how many 4 plus 4 plus 4 understand okay page number 32 little bit deep kame tevi se pakani punya punyani visati ekadas kriya cheti chatupanyas sabbatha 
Kame Tevisa Pakani. Kame in the sensual sphere, plane. Tevisa 23 Pakani are resultant. How many resultant consciousness in the sensual plane? 23. Okay, good. What are the 23? Yeah. Two, two eye consciousness, two ear consciousness, two nose consciousness, two tongue consciousness, two body consciousness, two receiving consciousness, three types of investigating consciousness. Total there are 15. Then today we study eight types of resultant mind, great resultant mind. Total how many? 23. Don't forget, huh? Punya punya ni visati. 20 are 20 are unwholesome and wholesome. Means there are 12 types of unwholesome, 8 types of wholesome. Do you remember? What are the 12 types of unwholesome? Yeah, eight greed mind, two, two hatred mind, two delusion mind, eight loba, eight dosa, eight moha. Sorry, eight loba, two dosa, two moha. There are eight types of wholesome. What are the eight types of wholesome? Yeah, we already study now. Just now finish. Okay? There are four types of happiness mind, four types of equanimity mind, one way, according to the feeling. According to the knowledge, four types of wisdom, four types of unwisdom. According to the prompting, four types of unprompted, four types of prompted. And Ekadasa Kriya Cheti. There are 11 types of functional consciousness. What are the 11 types of functional? Eight types of great functional consciousness. Now we already studied now. Just now finish. Before yesterday I explained there are three types of Functional. One is the Fido adverting consciousness. Next one, Mindo adverting consciousness. And smile producing consciousness. Three. How many? Three. All total, eleven. Chatupanyasa sabbata. There are all together fifty four consciousness. Uh, now, according to the sensual plane, how many consciousness? 54. Now, we already studied 54 consciousness. Okay? I think the, the, those are not no enough to understand fully regarding the old Abhidhamma. That's why you, you can uh, read the manual of Abhidhamma, there the English book. Uh, you can read and you try to get the more detail, okay? Uh, at the time, very easy to continuously uh, join this class. Uh, otherwise, maybe if not clear, the, please ask from us also. If you cannot ask, you try to read the book regarding Abhidhamma, okay? Today no more other question, no? <clears throat> Tomorrow, the, I'm teaching uh, fine material
consciousness and immaterial consciousness about the meditation regard because of the according to meditation object how we enter the jhana how we get the jhana consciousness okay there are different type of jhana the first jhana second jhana third jhana fourth jhana fifth jhana according to abhidhamma according to the sutta especially first second third and fourth the same way the immaterial also there are four type of jhana boundless consciousness uh same way explaining there are uh, jhana consciousness okay tomorrow we will explain according to the meditation object how we get the jhana consciousness how we understand okay but when we are teaching the jhana the every time they have a the relationship with the the sensual plane consciousness also we are combined together when you are teach explaining uh, the everything uh, because the someone want to get the jhana consciousness uh before the jhana arising preparation mind hmm? ss consciousness and uh, uh, one of the the lineage consciousness etc arising those are also the wholesome mind the great one of the great wholesome mind uh, because of that you don't forget the your previous notes also that you can bring because if you uh, if you by heart is okay it's, i still not it by heart but bring the your previous notes that when i teach in the uh, jhana consciousness we need the, to take the, some example some reference from the previous notes also okay i think today enough no okay we sharing merits <coughs> इदम मे पुण्य आसवाखया वहां हो तो इदम मे पुण्य निबाणस पाचयो हो तो मम पुण्य भागं सब सतानं भाजेमि ते सबे मे समं पुण्य भागं लभन्तु साधु 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 सुखे